What's up, YouTube? We're back with round two of the sour, super sour challenge for tonight. And of course, you guys, if you watched round one, you saw me destroy the challenge. I completely knocked it out. No big deal. Even eating a lemon, not really a big deal. Maybe it's because I am a lemon. Who knows? So, because that was so easy, I think tonight we're going to do something a little, a little different. We're going to do what's hotter. I got three sauces this week from Chili Childs. They're all among the hottest sauces you could buy. So we're going to do what's hotter and see which of the three is the hottest. And I'm going to try them all. And if these are as hot as they're supposed to be, I should pay some kind of a price. So we're going to find out. And we're going to find out now. Since that lemon challenge might have messed up my mouth, I'm not sure how these are going to taste tonight, but I'm sure they're going to burn. So I think we're going to start, uh, what should we start with first? Should we start with the, the ghost pepper? The ghost pepper. Let's start with the ghost pepper. This would be the least probably hot of the bunch. So this is uh, Kajan's Holy Jalokia ghost pepper sauce. And... Uh, I'm just gonna, just gonna open it up. We'll probably shake it. We'll open it up, see what it's all about. We got a lot of stuff we're gonna be doing in the next few weeks. Oh, make sure you click that button there. Subscribe to that button, or subscribe to the channel by clicking that button. Make sure you do it. So right here, you know, click this and uh, keep this thing going because we got a lot more stuff. We got some chocolate challenges coming. I think next week we're gonna do the. Uh, the one chunk challenge, I think. And, uh, oh, right now the uh, Bare Knuckle FC is on. So, uh, you know, we're going to go back down and watch that. The Leafs are uh, also playing, but we've got that on pause. Not that it matters to anybody watching this. It'll be over by then. So, oh, this one's got a restrictor. We don't like that. Restrictors come out. Ooh, I smell uh, this one. This one smells. Ooh. Okay, so this one, the ingredients are vinegar, root jalokia, jalokia chilies, which is ghost pepper, sugar, salt, granulated garlic, lemon extract, and xanthan gum. National, that's a thickener. Okay. Wow, it smells peppery. It smells very peppery. I guess I'll have to... Uh, there we go. Okay. We're just avoiding the inevitable here. Let's just do this. Okay, give her a good shake. Let's let's see how the first one tastes. Let's see how hot this is. This is one of the hottest sauces I could buy. So let's see. Pour is good. Looks good. Whoa! Tastes good. There's a lot of ghost pepper in that. I don't know if it's because of the sour stuff. My teeth still feel funny. My mouth feels funny. So that's adding to the weird effect that's going on right now in my mouth. But yeah, this is uh, this got quite a punch when you first taste it. It's good. It's good stuff. Holy Jalokia. It's hot. I'm not sweating yet, but it's it's there. It's hot. Mouth is hot, but it's tasty. So I think I'm going to enjoy this. This this seems like something I can have a lot of things. Yeah, it's hot. I'm definitely it's in my throat a little bit. Okay, moving on to Flame of Thrones. I know Chris has been excited about the Flame of Thrones sauce. I know he wants to try it. I've got him trying some sauces on ice cream today. He's kind of acting like a man. Now if I can get Calvin here to do it, I'll be really impressed. We'll see. But Chris is going to try to Flame Thrones, aren't you Chris? We'll see. Flame Thrones is no big deal. Flame of Thrones for the champ is going to be just like a little bit of a heartwarming episode of uh, joy. Distilled vinegar, scorpion peppers, 
red habaneros, water mustard, mustard seeds, salt, turmeric, garlic, onions, cumin, xanthan again, turmeric again, salt, and black pepper. Hmm. Turmeric saying it twice. That's weird, isn't it? Different form. Different form. One's more pure than the other. Okay. Well. That I won't spill my throat. This one's no joke. I give this one more shake. So this is a Trinidad Scorpion. Now the other one I have that's a Scorpion. That's a stinging sauce. And uh, in my one sauce experience with Trinidad Scorpion peppers, this now would be my second. It smells like the other one. So I assume that's what they smell like. So let's see how thick this one is. Pours out like the other one. Oh, there's some chunks. This one looks kind of peppery. Let's see how good it is. There it is. At first it was kind of like a, like a spaghetti sauce almost. Is there even, I don't think there is. I don't think there's pinned tomatoes in it. Wow, it's hot. <laughs> Whoa. Is there a tomato? I can't read it, I can't focus. No, it's not. But maybe it was the habaneros are fruity. But there's the scorpion sting. And yeah, that's a good one too. That is a hot sauce on top of the other one there. Flame of Thrones. Champ approves of that one. Last but not least, this is one we've all been looking forward to, especially Chris. This is Don't Fear the Reaper. This sauce, the pineapple sauce. Might be good on dessert, might not be. Chris has ice cream, we want to try it on it. So this one, the ingredients start with Carolina Reaper peppers, scotch bonnet peppers, pineapple, carrots, shallots, 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 vinegar, garlic, lime juice, sea salt, olive oil, and brown sugar. It's got a very fancy wine wrap on the top. Wow, my tongue is a little bit lit up from that one. Good sauce. Is this cork? No. <sighs> wow. Definitely hotter. And this might be the hottest with Reapers being the first ingredient. No restrictor again. Way to go to these guys. That's good. Alright. I don't smell anything. I think I'm burned out now. Ugh. Here we go. There it comes. Oops, chunky a little bit. Uh, oh. It's like a pineapple puree. Here we go. Don't fear the Reaper. I'm gonna crush this. Yep, Reapers. But that's a good one, actually. It's not like the cherry one where the sweet kind of really balances it out. That's got some bite to it. But it's tasty. And I think this would go good on ice cream. And there's the pepper now. Now I get the pepper flavor. Yep. Yeah, these are... Uh, Definitely hotter sauces. Way hotter than what I'm used to. And, uh, you know, a bit of a challenge even after doing that toe of Satan last week, which, by the way, thanks again, everybody, for tuning in for that one and uh, subscribing to make that happen. And if you want me to do these crazier challenges, we've got to get to 150 plus. So make sure you click that button there and subscribe. I'm going to keep this going. Next week, we're going to do the uh, 
the one trunk challenge. Anyways, I really love doing this. These were all fiery hot sauces, but friggin' delicious fiery hot sauces. And I'm gonna enjoy them. I may be lit up right now, but I'm uh, I'm not doing too bad. I would say I'm about a three. Now I don't know if any one of these is hotter than the other. That I can't judge right now. I think I started hot. I think this did get hotter. I think this was a different kind of hot. So, you know, I think every pepper gets you differently. So it's, it's really hard to judge, but they're all hot. I'm sweating. And this was punishment compared to the, uh, the uh, super sour challenge, which I knocked out. So everybody like, share, subscribe, click that button there. Let's keep this going. Thanks for watching. These things were great. Next week, we're going to have something great for you too. So appreciate y'all for tuning in. Thanks for watching. See you next week.